Fernando Alonso has revealed what occurred after he held talks with the FIA at the Miami Grand Prix. Fernando Alonso has offered an insight into talks he held with FIA President Mohamed Ben Suleim at the Miami Grand Prix over the weekend, labeling his discussions as useful and praising the governing body's chief for always listening to the drivers. Alonso was left furious after the sprint race in Miami. The Spaniard was caught up in a lap one incident with Lewis Hamilton and teammate Lance Stroll, giving him a puncture and taking his Aston Martin colleague out of the race entirely. Eventual Grand Prix winner Lando Norris was also taken out in the process soddling. A review from the stewards, Hamilton was cleared of any wrongdoing, and the four-car clash was labeled as a racing incident. This decision incensed Alonso, who suggested after the race that nationality is playing a role in deciding which drivers receive penalties for certain incidents. We'll see what they decide. I guess they won't decide anything, because he's not Spanish, he fumed after the sprint. But I think he ruined the race for a few people, especially Norris, who had a very fast car, and he was out in that incident. He later clarified these comments, adding, I do feel that nationality matters. I will speak with Mohammed Ben Sulaim, with the FIA. Whatever I need to make sure that there is not anything wrong with my nationality or anything that can influence any decision. Not only for me, but also for the future generation of Spanish drivers that need to be protected. Alonso followed through on his word. Discussing his concerns with the FIA president before leaving Miami for the weekend, the veteran two-time champion has been punished on a number of occasions this season, including controversial penalties at the races in Melbourne and Shanghai. Assessing the success of his talks with Ben Sulaim, Alonso said, yeah, useful with him yesterday. He's always on board with every opinion that the drivers have. He knows that we are the ones driving the cars and that we can have some suggestions on things. There are a couple of points that we need to address as a sport. He always listens to us. Between all, if we make F1 a better sport and a little bit more consistent, 